Hi everyone, it's Fitz with your daily delivery. Hope you're doing well. I am wonderful. It's a beautiful day in the Flint Hills. You know I'm a big fan of special teams because Kansas State football just leaned on it so much through the years. But now the rules have really changed the game. And I think the rules need to change even more. Hey, remember to please subscribe to this YouTube channel, hit the thumbs up and leave those comments. When I saw what the XFL was going to do with kickoffs, I scoffed. And then I saw how it actually played out and I liked it. And now the NFL has decided to follow with these rule changes. And if you don't know what they are, they're radical and they work. No more big bodies crashing into each other at top speed. The kicker remains where they're kicking from, but the other 10 guys move up five yards removed from the return team. And the return team has to have no more than two guys deep. They're all at the line. You gotta be at the line of scrimmage. No more of the scattered guys back. Nope, it's 10 guys against nine or 10 guys, five yards apart. Here comes the kick. Now there's some rules about uh, the, how it has to be in the landing zone, okay? If you kick it out of the end zone, it doesn't just come out as a touchback. In the NFL, it's gonna be at the 35 or the 40. It's gonna be a severe penalty. You want the ball returned. So they're putting the return game back into the game because they settled the issue of these big bodies colliding at full speed by moving the players who are running downfield and the players blocking for the returners only five yards apart. It's really interesting. It's a radical change. College football's not doing it, and I want them to encourage, be encouraged to do so. And I, I hope they look at what the NFL does and says, hey, that works. I actually hope they just get together this summer and say, hell with it, we're gonna change the rules right now. Because kickoff returns are so important to the game. And the rules they have in, in terms of uh, being able to kick it and get a fair catch and, you know, they've just neutered special teams. They've just taken it out of the game in terms of kickoff returns. And I think the game is worse for that. This also opens up interesting, like, job-specific specific things that some players might do. You might look for different things in a kickoff returner. I've seen it online that now Deuce Vaughn's value to the Dallas Cowboys might be enormous because he is very good at evading players in tight spaces, which means more thrilling kickoff returns. We'll see what the NFL does with it. I'm kind of in on it, but we probably do need more information. But it wouldn't hurt my feelings if college followed in the same way. As long as Kansas State's special teams coaches realize this, that part of the game is really important. you got to be good in it. You don't mess around with special teams at K-State and do it half well, you know what. Because that's kind of the way it was done this past season. And I think K-State would have been much better off with more dynamic returns. But the rules haven't been friendly to the teams who value special teams.